So let's meditate. Let's start by pulling all of our attention back to ourselves by concentrating on our breaths, concentrating on our breathing. So take a deep breath in. And let it all go. Take another deep breath in. And let it all go again. Take another deep breath in. And let it all go. Continue to follow the rhythm of your own breathing with the intention of elongating your breathing as much as it is still comfortable for you. So slowly breathe in until you cannot breathe in anymore and then slowly let go of your breath. And as you slow down your own breathing, you also send a signal to your body that it is time to relax. It is okay to relax. It is safe to relax. And each time as you breathe out, let your body become more relaxed as well. Let go of not just your breath, but let go of the tension in your body as well. And each time you breathe in, breathe in infinite possibilities. Bring in more possibilities for yourself, for your body. Bring in more energy for your body. To use however it sees best to use. Allow yourself to calm down, not just your body, but also calm down your mind as well. Allow your mind to focus or refocus itself in your heart. Your heart is roughly in the middle of your body. So as you focus on your heart, you are centering yourself as well. Get in touch with your heart. Your heart is where your soul communicates with you. Where the non-physical part of you touches the physical part of you. So as you focus on your heart, 
you're focusing on all parts of yourself, both the physical and the non-physical parts of yourself. Invite all of you to come back to center. Come back to yourself. Let all your senses be focused on yourself within you. Get in touch with your own essence. Set the intention to bring in the highest vibration version of you, the highest that you can possibly have access to while in this body. And allow yourself to feel that. Allow yourself to feel the highest vibration version of yourself coming into you through the top of your head, all the way connecting to you in your heart. And from your heart, connect to all the rest of your body, to each and every cell of your body, bringing in your own essence. Allow your whole physical body to be connected to the highest vibration version of you that you have access to while still in this miraculous body that is your vessel. While you're exploring this life stream And when you feel yourself connected to this highest vibration version of you and set an intention to visualize and create your own spiritual home. Imagine yourself being in an environment that is most comfortable for you. If you feel most comfortable when you are near water, then imagine yourself walking along the beach. If you feel most comfortable when you're in nature and imagine yourself walking in nature with trees and birds around you, with the sun shining on you. Whatever brings you the most pleasant feeling that makes you most comfortable Imagine yourself in that setting. See yourself in that setting. And as you are walking in this comfortable setting,
imagine yourself walking towards your own spiritual home. Whatever your spiritual home may look like is entirely up to you. You can create and imagine the most beautiful cathedral or the most simple place to be your own spiritual home. However you want your own spiritual wholeness, just you imagine yourself walking up to that spiritual home and put your hand on the door and know that this door recognizes your handprint. It knows you. It knows your DNA. And only you can get in there. And as you walk in, the door closes behind you automatically. And you are safe in your own spiritual home. And imagine yourself walking inside this building and allow yourself to turn around 360 degrees and simply look around and see in with your mind's eye your own spiritual home. Whatever you see in here is absolutely perfect for you. As you look around, feel what it feels like when you're here. And should you feel more comfortable to be escorted around in your own spiritual home, then invite whomever it is that you feel you trust most to be in here with you as well. And now explore your own spiritual home and look around your own spiritual home and find the room that says go in first. This could be any room that you wish it to be. It could be your library. It could be your back lock room. It could be the room where the most important message that you needed to get for this moment is waiting for you. So go inside this room, open the door and walk inside. Everything in this room 
is arranged perfectly for you. You may see window or many windows in here, or you may see pictures on the wall. You may see shelves. You may see chairs, sofas. Just allow yourself to get familiar with this room. Look around this room 360 degrees and go towards a direction that you feel drawn to go towards. Whatever catches your attention first, whether it is a book, a piece of paper, or it may be someone in there that has a message for you, or it may be just a very comfortable chair that seemed to invite you to go over, whatever it is that draws your attention, go towards it and spend some time with whatever it is that attracted you. There's a message for you and that's your own spiritual home wants you to know. It could be as simple as welcome home. We're really glad that you finally made it in here. Or it could be something that they want you to know that may make a difference for you tomorrow or next year. And have no expectation of what the message may be. The message may simply be, I love you. You are worthy. And have no expectations that you may consciously know what the message is. Simply allow the message to come to you when it is ready. After you have spent a little bit of time in this room to receive this message, whether consciously or energetically, if you feel that it is received, Message received. Then you can start to come out of this room.
and as you come out of this room, look for your council room, the room where all your guides, your spirit guides, are there waiting for you. And when you find that room, go over there and open the door and walk in this council room. And know that your spirit guides are in there. The team who has helped you all along, whether you know it or not, whether you can hear their whisper in your ears or not, you have never been alone. They have always been by your side. And they are in here. And with you. Have no expectations that you will be able to see them. Or even feel them. They may come to you as a scent, a unique scent, a smell, a sweetness in the air, or it could be as simple as simply a sense of well-being when you're in this room, knowing that they're here with you. They are in this room. And they have never left your life. They have always been around for you. They are the ones who have assisted you before you come into this life stream. They assisted you to finalize all the details of this life stream. And they are here with you all along, walking just below consciousness with you. However you experience your spirit guides is uniquely 
yours. They may speak with you or they may not. Have absolutely no expectations. Simply spend some time with them. Even though they are always with you. But when you are here, you consciously choose to spend time with them. And they know it. So these times are precious. It's never enough time to spend in here. However, for now, let us leave this room. Thank all your guides. And feel their love for you. Their pure love from spirit to spirit, without judgment, without any expectations. So with this pure love in your heart, come out of this room and as you close the door behind you, walk back into the middle of this room, the middle of your spiritual home and look around. And as you look up into the ceiling, Know that there are many floors in this spiritual home of yours. Even though you may only see one floor for now, there are many, many floors within your spiritual home. Each floor allows you to communicate with the higher vibration version of you. And perhaps one day, it's time for you to explore the other floors but for right now, just know that the upper floors are there, whether they are visible or not. And when you're in the middle of your spiritual home, feel yourself being connected to 
all of you. To the all eternal, limitless parts of you. It's all accessible in here. And all of you is available for you to explore when the timing is right. And you are the one that determines when the time is right. So for now, simply be in the middle of this spiritual home of yours to receive all the communications from all versions of you Feel their energy flowing through you. And know that all parts of you, everywhere, everyone, everything is available for you all the time. Right here in your own spiritual home. And you can connect to all of you. Allow all that wave of communication coming to you. And know that all of these codes, that all versions of you is communicating with you, that you, your body, knows how to process this energy. You may not know what to do with it consciously, but your body knows how to process all this energy intuitively. That is what your body is designed to do. It's a miraculous vessel that you have. And when you feel that wave of information starting to slow down, then you know it is time to leave your spiritual home for the time being. And you are welcome and encouraged to come here and explore as often as you feel called to or not. It is all your choice. For now, just take one more look around. and walk towards the door. And as you walk towards the door, 
a door opens for you. And when you are outside, the door will automatically close behind you. And you can now walk back. to that comfortable place that you started from and simply take a deep breath in and let it all go. Take another deep breath in And let it all go. Take one more deep breath in. Let it all go and come all the way back into your body, into this moment. And when you're ready, open your eyes and come all the way back to now.